50 to 85,000. That means the poll may be 90,000. Ardent Basaumat, a legislator from Nongkrem, is swimming against the tide, pushing for clean politics in Meghalaya. He expects to win, but is not sure if change is round the corner. The present situation is, uh, is quite uncertain. We never know which party will come to power and uh, how many parties will share. At least 18 assembly candidates for the Congress or the UDP have stakes in coal or cement mining, the most powerful lobby in Meghalaya that can topple governments at will. The last five years have seen four governments and even presidents rule. You have the coal lobby on the one side, they are very strong, they have so many candidates this time. Then you have the cement lobby on the other side, all of them are jostling for power, for control over the government. It's, uh, it's something like, uh, you know... Chief uh, Minister Mukul Sangma is well aware of the problems that his state faces from such lobbies. In the past, they have tried to dictate during my time also, but they have failed. Okay, so it's not that the same similar situation will be seen in the future. In 2012, we filmed illegal mines operating in the mineral-rich Jaintia Hills. Violations often shielded by locally obtained no-objection certificates. Many of the headmen, local people, even Daloy also, who was, who was the head of the Ilaka, they have uh, bought by the cement company to support them. That is very difficult for us as the Giant Youth Federation to fight with the cement company. And yet 66% of Meghalaya lives below the poverty line. As the state votes in 2013, the promise of stability and change seems distant. With Arijit Sen in Shillong, this is Rohit Khanna.